ah, you there. Good academic. I come to you from a world where passing through time is as simple as passing through a door frame. Now tell me, have your fledgling brains discovered traversable wormholes yet? <laughs> of course you haven't. Far too advanced for your primitive brains. Allow me to educate you on the theory behind time travel and wormholes. Let's begin by constructing our wormholes. Wormholes are a theoretical tear in space-time. It's structure resembling a tunnel connecting two separate points in space-time. The wormhole we are constructing is known as a traversable wormhole. Our traversable wormhole would have to have no event horizon hindering it from two-way travel, and would have to be large enough not to obliterate travelers who pass through it. The biggest issue we have in creating and maintaining these wormholes stems from our old nemesis, gravity. Gravitational forces would constantly be trying to collapse the wormhole and create black holes at the ends of it. To combat this, we need a special ingredient. Exotic matter. Exotic matter is speculated to have negative mass, making it unique among all other types of matter. While normal matter attracts other matter, exotic matter is another matter entirely. It repels other matter and counteracts gravity, meaning if we were to apply it to our man-made wormholes, it would balance the forces to keep the wormholes stable. Now that we have our stable traversable wormhole, we now have a means to move near instantaneously through space. For right now, going through our wormhole would have no effect on our coordinates in time. To achieve that, we'll need to trigger a time shift. We can do this by accelerating one of the wormhole's openings to near light speed by electromagnetic or gravitational means. Triggering a time shift between the two openings. We then return the wormhole to its original position. And now, traveling through one opening and exiting from the other will now affect both your place in space and time! Well, my work here is done. And I'm sure there's been no paradoxical side effects to me coming here whatsoever. Godspeed. <laughs>